If you can suffer through setbacks, through pain, rise up with resilience once again and again and again. One day, this world will tap you on the shoulder and say, this is your time to shine. You can have, be, and do anything you want. You just have to believe. It is... It's the morning and my boyfriend just went to work and I am going to have my breakfast and my shirt goes, um, carbs go straight to my boobs. This was like an old shirt from like Trisha Paytas like back in the day when I was like a big fan, I, I mean when I was like, I just started like watching her and I'm like, like, I was like, I'm still totally obsessed with her but like I was like really obsessed, like I bought every clothing that she's ever like put out, like any like merch. But, like, I feel like this was, like, the best merch she's ever put out, like, ever. Like, cars go straight to my boobs. Like, that is, like, so me. Like, I was just listening to, um, inspirational, um, speeches. Like, I've been into that a lot. And it, like, builds up your confidence and your mind. And it just makes you, it just empowers you. I don't know. It just makes, because it's, like, the attention's on you. And they're speaking to you. And they're giving you, like, compliments and, and, and try to put you back on track. But this po this podcast, this um, this speech really touches me, and it has the word that I love, believe, and it's called "Believe in Yourself." It's by the Fearless Soul. Fearless Soul um, speeches are really, um, they're very inspirational. They get deep down into your soul. They they change the way you think. You are. I feel every time when I leave, when I, every time when I finish listening to at least one of their speeches, I always, like, at the end of it, I always feel more empowered, more centered, more focused. Um, sometimes you just lose yourself in the world because of all, like, the problems and that are going around, all the difficult times, and, you know, you're in debt or, you know, family problems and um, your job, your friends, your just everyday life just gets in the way and... Sometimes you need to listen to something like that to really get you centered and focused and sh and really seeing what your life purpose is and get you back on track. Um, don't take no for an answer um, because nothing comes easy. Nothing good ever comes easy. Um, if it does, then it wasn't meant for you and it was just temporary. I learned that for a fact. Um, my life purpose, I feel, is, is this, YouTube. I never... Like, let's, let's just get it. We'll talk about that. You're here for the food, and then we'll chat. But I have Dunkin' Donuts. Um, this is, of course, I had to get the frozen caramel um, coffee. And now it's, like, it's melting. Um, but, yeah, so I have the frozen um, coffee. I mean, there's still ice. And then <gasps> I'm so excited for this. I'm just letting you know. I look really like mortified. <laughs> no, I look I look like I just woke up and I did. But <gasps> look. What is that? What does that look like? It is a pumpkin muffin. It is that time of year, ladies and gentlemen. When we start drinking pumpkin lattes and eating pumpkin muffins and getting heavier. Mmm. I love pumpkin. Mmm. So good. People may say they don't like the pumpkin muffin from Dunkin' Donuts. Because sometimes in the middle could be a little raw or a little mushy. I don't like the other M word, moist. Ugh, it bothers me. Ugh, moist. It's mushy. That's better. It's mushy. Um, yeah. This is the only muffin I really eat the whole thing. I mean, top and middle. Because some muffins, like, you only eat the top is, like, the best part. And then the center, you really just, like, chuck it away which is a sin because that's food but 
this muffin is the only muffin I can eat the whole thing. And it tastes good. Oh my god. I've missed you. Throughout the whole summer and spring season. You're back. I'm happy you're back. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. And then one comes like Thanksgiving. I'm sick of it. Actually when, when it comes like Halloween. I'm very sick of it. But oh my god. Whoever created this. Thank you. Thank you. You have my full gratitude. I'm so grateful for pumpkin muffins. They're a life changer. And the coffee. Mm. I had to put this on because. You know they sell like cup covers. And they're like expensive. I think they're like $5. But it keeps it cool. But. I mean. I would spend $5 on a cup holder. I mean. I would just use it so you don't get that condensation. But all you do is just wrap. A paper towel around it does the same thing. And actually, it absorbs the, the moisture. Okay, so what were we talking about? We were talking about... The speech. See, I have to write things down because I forgot. Maybe it wasn't meant for me to talk about. I remember. And now when I watch back this, this video, I'm going to be like, oh, that's it. <laughs> um, I said, no, well, I was talking about that. Like, that I'm going to put it out there, like, really what I want to do. I want, I want to be a social media influencer. I want to put myself out there. I'm going to be that social media influencer. I'm going to be just like everyone else on YouTube. Extra drama because... I don't, you know, I just, I just want to live in the moment. I want to influence other people. I want to give people, um, hope and because of all the stuff I've been through, um, I've never gave up. I fought through it. Um, but the only hardest thing that I have ever tried to succeed and it's just, and I want it so bad. You don't know. I want this so bad. I want to become a full-time social media influencer. And this this is what I was talking about. This, this situation, this YouTube idea just fell in my lap. I never really thought of looking up uh, I mean I never saw like an advertisement about YouTube videos um I never thought I would be watching videos on YouTube I just thought YouTube was thing to listen to music or watch music videos because there's no more like MTV or watching a skit from a favorite show that you can laugh about over and over again because somebody films it or posts it on their page um um or, I mean, I was posting videos on YouTube never to think, like, they meant anything. I just felt like YouTube was, like, a Facebook to, to like, hoard, like, all your videos that you um posted. Because at that time, when I knew about posting videos, um, when I was posting videos, the... What was I saying? At the time of like posting videos, we were just posting it on YouTube because there was no place to post videos. But like now, like you can post videos anywhere. You can post videos on Facebook, Instagram. We have Snapchat now that it's only really predominantly videos. Um, and there's Twitter. But now YouTube has become so evolved. And now like people don't even like have cable like you find real reality tv on youtube people bring you around show their life like i do it i bring people around show my life i mean there's i mean i hate when people say oh well i don't i don't want to be like a person to be like oh well i don't film all the time because i don't find my life exciting which some people will like 
I don't know, like Trisha Paytas can film herself just sitting on the couch and talking and I would watch, I would watch in, uh, she could sit, I'm sorry, I was trying to get some, like my sentences are horrible, um, she could sit on the couch and talk for an hour straight and I would find that so interesting, just watching her and I would watch her from the beginning to end for an hour straight, but for me, I don't know if somebody would want me to sit here when I'm here, I'm home all the time. Um, like, listening to me. I mean, if I was a fan of myself, I would. But some people just don't, they don't like that. They'll, they'll click off or they'll get bored or, I don't know. Um, I'm hope I'm interesting. I, I'm a class act, let me tell you. But, whatever. But that is my dream. That is my wish. I mani I want. I'm going to manifest it and putting it out there in the universe. Like, I want to be a social media influencer. I'm putting it out there in the universe and letting it go. Um, I don't know how. I don't know when. But I know. I'm deep down inside. It's coming to me because this idea of doing YouTube has never left my mind one second. I've been going to school i went to college i got my bachelor's degree when i was in high school i knew i wanted to be a teacher i was going for school i was going to go to school for teaching and go to college i'm gonna be a teacher like i said i don't know how i don't know when this is gonna happen i don't know what video that's gonna um push me out and get viral and put me on the map or give me some clout or what youtuber is going to come across my channel i've manifested so many times that i want like trisha paytas to acknowledge me and i wanted to become friends with trisha paytas and everything else like i just felt i every day i kept felt feeling like like this is my my dream like i i can analyze how it's gonna happen what's gonna happen what I'm gonna feel like what I'm gonna look like when that dream comes true and it's not even a dream that's my life that's my purpose that's my because it hasn't left like going back now I got sidetracked like when I went to when I was in high school I knew that I was gonna be a teacher like I wanted to teach I wanted to teach um little kids I, that's what I was doing and while I was in college something I, w I still had that mindset. I still said I was going to go for teaching and everything else. I feel like my eyes are so, like, black. Do you see a shadow? Should I move this? Okay. Like, I knew it. I had it all planned and, every and everything else. Um. Oh, no! Mm. It's all right. It's okay. I just, I just knew that was my idea of what I see myself in the future. Then I'm going to show the universe, you know what, I'm ready. Everything that I've been thinking about, I'm ready for it. Like I said, I don't know when it's, they're going to give it to me. I don't know how, but I know it's coming to me. But yeah, that is my mukbang, having my Dunkin' Donuts breakfast. I feel like every mukbang that I create is always like Dunkin' Donuts, but like that's really what I live on. Like most of the time I'm like, it's either breakfast and dinner and usually breakfast is like Dunkin Donuts because everyone all of New York runs on Dunkin because it's I think it's better than Starbucks you have more options at Dunkin and they have stepped up their game within their the past year or so Dunkin is the way to go and dinner time is like wherever we want to go eat and I'm probably going to every time I eat dinner I will film a mukbang because I mean, this channel is not always going to be solely on, like, mukbangs and stuff, but that's what videos are, are really skyrocketing on my channel. So, you guys have, um, have requested by watching my mukbang video, so I'm going to create more of them because you guys love them. Don't know what to say, but thank you for watching my mukbang for Dunkin' Donuts. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, dolls.